<laughs> Good morning, everybody. Ms. Mabel is joining us this morning. Don't get camera shy now, now. Uh, it is Thursday. It is May 20th, and it is National Rescue Dog Day, Randy. Did you why know that? Mabel is here. Yes, she yes. is. Uh -huh. Of course, Patty Spitler is in the house as well. Mabel, look, you're on TV. There she is, <laughs> looking right at the camera. Uh -huh. Hi, baby. Well, good morning, everybody. Thank you so much for joining us on this Thursday. Yeah, the baby talk. I know we're not supposed to do that. That's what the, oh, the dog whisperer right. says. We're supposed that's to be right. very. Hello, Mabel. Welcome to the show. <laughs> Exactly like that, right? <laughs> exactly like that. It seems like it's going to be a nice day outside. It was beautiful walking in. Yeah, she's already going. <sighs> yeah. Because of the lights in here. Because of all the lights thing. Be, make sure you get plenty of water to the pets the next several days. That's right. Because we're talking mid 80s for a high. Mid 80s, yeah, I know. It's going to be too. pretty warm this weekend. Yep, yep. Yes, it is. Okay, well, hey, coming up, you guys, in the kitchen, we have Chef Ryan because we are making a seafood favorite dish with Chef Ryan. All right, what you got cooking over there, man? We're doing jumbled up crab cakes today. Ooh. Ooh, crab cakes. Mm -hmm. What yeah. do you think about Everybody that? Like that okay. sounds good, right? I, I will try it. Yes. I love crab. Did you hear what else is on the menu? Tell them, Ryan, what else is on the menu coming up a little later? We're going to do a savory caver uh, caviar pie. Ooh. Caviar pie, are you up for that? I will try that too, yes. You know everything he makes is delicious. I anyways. told him before the show, whoever comes on this show, even if I'm like, eh, yeah. it's delicious. Yes, and you're such a good sport because you're willing to try oh, even absolutely. though you're not sure. Yeah. And let's just say, how many times do you do that and you're like, huh? Yeah. I don't think you've had a dish, correct me if I'm wrong, that you were like, oh, I don't quite like that yet. Because we had, what was it, grits and shrimp. Grits and, and shrimp. that was one I thought, oh, man, it was delicious. It was delicious. It was great. The way you guys cook it, it's, yes. it's the passion in her face. I know. They love doing I don't cook at all. Cooking with love, right? Doing. And I tell kids that, too, in school. It's go after your passion in life. Mm -hmm. It's not about fame. It's not about money. Do something yep. that you really enjoy. Because after that, the rest will follow yep. for sure. Yep. Hey, also coming up this morning on Indie Style with people returning to work after the pandemic, your pet may be a bit anxious, right? Yeah. It's it's tough because we're talking about separation anxiety. So we have some yeah. advice on keeping your pooch calm and happy. So there you go. And then coming up, you have a big interview. I do. I'm excited about this here. The legendary voice of the uh, Indy 500 has a new book out. Yeah, show, here, us, guys, the book, show anyway, us the book. Anyway, this is it right here. It's uh, Paul Page. He's going to be live in our studio. I mean, he goes way back. So yeah. I'm looking forward to uh, chatting with him. And uh, he's he's been around the block a few times. Yeah, that's fantastic. Yeah. I know you were talking with Scott Sander a little bit earlier. I mean, he is a big, big race guy, right? Oh, Scott, yeah. Yeah. So, yeah, he is. I, I know mean, he would oh. love to be doing that but Absolutely. it's nice it is nice to have someone maybe who's yeah. not compl just to have a nice perspective right on yeah. questions to ask somebody like yeah. this I, legendary I, man I'm not a huge race fan but right. I don't dislike it but I, I'm looking forward to talking to Mr. Page Absolutely all right guys that's coming up here in just a little bit as we said it's National Rescue Dog Day so we're encouraging you to adopt a homeless pet we'll have more with Patty coming up in just a little bit but first uh, you got some socks given to you yep. by a viewer yeah, these uh, came in the mail at the station yesterday. They didn't yes. leave their name. I tried to find their name, but they just said, hey, oh, Randy, man. love, you know, your socks. Look at so that. These are donut socks. So I know it's kind of hard to tell, but there's different kind of oh, donuts. Mabel's out. I mean, well, <laughs> Mabel thinks they're real donuts, I think. But anyway. She gone. Whoever sent these to me, thank you very much. And I said, I'll wear them. And Those are so great. There they are. So, and so colorful. And they pop. Do they make you hungry? Like, do you want to try to yes, grab, grab one of them like that. you think it's yes. a donut? <laughs> donut socks are amber, and also my pacer tie again. Yeah, go pacers. Because they have a big game tonight. This won't be, won't be a tough game tonight, but they're all tough yeah. as we get ready for the playoffs. So. Yeah, there you go. All right, you guys, let's get to today's question of the day because it is brought to you by Kitchen Saver Custom Cabinet Renewal. So today's question, Randy, we're going to show you the picture. There it is. I know you like sweets, but <laughs> one of these got to go. So which one are you going to pick? You've got the Ho-Ho, you have the Ding Dong, the Twinkie, and the Snowball. For me, no question, it's the Snowball. It's got to go. What do you think? You know, that's tough. I, I like know. Them. Oh, snowball. Snowball. I, I would pick that one. Okay, too. we're yeah. in agreement. Irene says snowball because I'm not a fan of coconut. Me either, Irene. Yeah, I love either. the yeah. flavor, Randy, but yeah, I cannot I, do I, that I texture. Can't. Yeah, I something know. about coconut just. I just, it's gritty in your teeth. Yeah, and it's kind of like when you take your fingernails on, on a, a chalkboard. chalkboard. <laughs> You know, see, we like see that. eye to eye with this yeah. one. All right, Irene, and <clears throat> thank you so much for that comment. Okay, what else do we have this morning? Let's see who else is chiming in and chatting with us. All right, I see Susan there, Rand. 
Uh, Twinkie, for obvious reasons here, no chocolate. Oh, no chocolate. Yeah. Oh, she likes the huh. chocolate. All right, Arthur says, Twinkie can go. I don't like anything with a shelf life longer than me. Give me snowballs <laughs> and a that's bib great. to catch all of the coconut that falls on my shirt. <laughs> oh, that's great. Oh, there you go. All right, you guys, thanks so much for chiming in. Uh, keep letting us know. Well, maybe we'll read some more of those coming up in just a little bit. Okay, have you ever been to Holiday World? Uh, I think we have. Yeah. Yes. Our boy, we were camping by. I, or, I can't remember if I went or not, but the yeah. family has been. The there. family. This was one of my favorite yeah. places to go as a it's kid. Great. I love it to this day. And everybody, turn your attention to the TV right now because we are giving you a chance to win two tickets to Holiday World and Surf and Safari. It's so simple. All you have to do is go to our website, IndyStyle.tv, and choose the contest page. You can enter right now. Win yourself two tickets. Save yourself some money and go have some fun. Can I enter this contest? No. Oh, I can't do that. Okay. <laughs> I'd like to do it. If you do and I see your name, I'm going to have to eliminate you. Well, maybe there'd be somebody named Randolfo Alice. Randolfo Alice. <laughs> Amberino Hankinsaw. <laughs> I don't know, something Ram like that. Ramber, <laughs> well, how about we go on over to oh, okay. Ryan Ono Nelsony, yeah. owner.